Hello friends, welcome to NEP Solutions. Today we will learn a new concept of chemistry. In that this is video, I am going to explain the concept of chemistry and that is lubricants. So first of all, we, we will know the definition of lubricants and the definition is the substance which reduce or control the friction between two surfaces is called lubricants so definition is th it is the substance lubricant is a substance it reduce or control the friction between two surfaces is called lubricant i think you know the definition of friction let me tell once again friction is nothing but the force that resist the sliding of an object against another means it is the force which resist the sliding of an object against the another and next the action of applying a substance such as oil or grease to an engine or component to minimize or reduce the friction is called lubrication means it's the overall process of applying the lubricant on a engine next we will learn about the characters of a good lubricants means the characters of the good lab lubricants and the characters are it should have a high viscosity high thermal stability and high oxidation resistance high boiling temperature and it should have a non corrosive nature it must have a non corrosive nature these are the characters of a good lubricants characters are over and then the functions of the good lubricant and the first function is to reduce the friction and the second one to avoid the wear and tear of surface means the protecting from the damages and next one increase the efficiency of machine efficiency means uh, uh, proper working of the machines they maintain the proper working of the machines and the next to prevent corrosion they prevent the corrosion and the last one to kept out the dust particles lubricants remove the dust particles from the engine or the machine so that is the basics about the lubricants then based on the physical property or state these lubricants are classified into three types mainly first one liquid lubricants solid lubricant uh, solid lubricants semi solid lubricants so the first type of lubricants is liquid lubricants and the definition is liquids that reduce friction between two moving surfaces by forming a thin layer are called as liquid lubricants they form a thin layer and these are also called as lubricating oils and the properties of liquid lubricants are it has the property of oiliness and resistance to oxidation and uh, these are thermally stable and they have a very moderate viscosity and they also have high boiling point again these liquid lubricants are classified into five types first one mineral oil vegetable oil animal oil blended oil and synthetic oil and next we will learn about detailed in the next the first one mineral oils these mineral oils are produced from the crude oil by distillation process and the, this crude oil is obtained from the earth crust and the distillation process you can apply like a fractional distillation process fractional distillation heating the substance at 4000 degree celsius and uh, these mineral oils are 
easily available and these are very cheap and if we come to users they are these are used for lubrication of mechanical components such as bearings chains gears slides and threaded connections in the machines these are the uses of the mineral oil and the second type of liquid lubricants is vegetable oils vegetable oils these are created from the extraction of oils from plant materials these are obtained from the plant sources and in this there are two types one is low graded vegetable oil and another one high graded vegetable oil and these low graded vegetable oils are used in delicate items like gun and watches and high graded vegetable is used as a food again there are three types in the vegetable oils and that is first one olive oil palm oil and castor oil so the first type is olive oil this olive oil is obtained or extracted from the olive seeds and the color of this olive oil is colorless to golden yellow these are available in the colorless form or golden yellow form and these are used in guns and watches etc and the second type is palm oil these palm oil is obtained or extracted from the palm seeds and the color of this palm oil is light yellow in color these are light yellow in color and the uses these are used in machine bearings and chains machine bearings these are this like and the third type castor oil this castor oil is obtained from the castor seeds and the color of this castor oil is colorless to pale green color and these are used in machineries and vehicles and the third type of liquid lubricant is animal oil and this animal oil is extracted from from the animal source mainly these are extracted from the skin and fat this animal oil is obtained from the skin and fat of the animal source and again in this there are three types one net foot oil and second one whale oil and third one lard oil and the first one net foot oil and this net foot oil is obtained from obtained by boiling the feet skin and shin bones of cattle these are obtained by the boiling of feet skin and shin bones of the cattle and its color is pale yellow these are available in the pale yellow color and it give a very pleasant smell and these are also used in guns and watches which are very delicate and another use of this net foot oil is these are used as conditioning softening and preservative agent for leather these are used for leather and the second type is whale oil whale oil these are obtained from the skin and fat of whales and these are available in the color pale yellow color and these are used in very light machines and the third type lard oil this lard oil is extracted from the skin and fat of pigs and the color of this lard oil is it is very, totally colorless and these are used in heavy machines and the fourth main type of liquid lubricant is blended oil or 
blending oil blended oil the name only tells that is it is a mixture of two oils the first mixture is mineral oil plus vegetable oil or animal oil it is a mixture of mineral oil or vegetable oil or animal oil why these mixtures are made because to improve the viscosity color and oxidative resistance and oiliness of the lubricants and the uses of this lubricants means blended oils are these are used in the heavy machines heavy machines like rocket engines jet planes submarines automobiles automobiles include car truck and many other vehicles fifth type of liquid lubricant that is synthetic oil so this is an man made or chemically prepared oil this is the chemically prepared oil and the example for this chemical or synthetic oils is dialkylated benzenes polyisobutylene these are the examples for synthetic oils and the uses of this synthetic oils is these are used in heavy machines aeroplanes helicopters and automobiles it is very similar to the similar to that of blended oils and this is about liquid lubricants we in this video we learned about the liquid lubricants in the next video we will learn about the solid lubricants hope you all got the information about the liquid lubricants if you have got any doubts please ask me in the comment box so if you like the video please subscribe and share thank you for watching